Yo, 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 and welcome to the Saints show. For first up, we got some injury news involving Mr. Will Smallbone. He come off on Saturday in a 4-4 draw against Norwich City, and they looked like he'd done something to his ankle, and Russ Martin announced this in the press after. They were going to do a scan. It looks like the scan has been done. And instead of weeks being out, it looks like months, which is bad, bad news for Saints as he started the season very, very well indeed. We're very impressed with Will. I think he'd be better in the eight position than the six, but still doing a job in the six. And that puts us really short in the sixth position with James Will Prowse leaving this week. Romeo Lavia looking like he's leaving as well. And coming on to the next piece of news, Flynn Downs is still not through the building. So what's happened with Flynn Downs? He has been sick, so he's not done his medical yet. But there is news coming out at the mo at this precise moment that it looks like the medical will be tomorrow. That will be Wednesday, and we're hoping that he can make his debut against Plymouth at half twelve on Saturday. So hopefully Flynn Downs through the building. I think we probably will need another one, if not even for a loan, if Will Smallbone is out for a whole month. Next up, we have a bid incoming for Sulemana. It looks like Everton have been interested and apparently are still interested. But it looks like Monaco are going to come in with a £25 million bid for the Ghanaian. Sulemana. Uh, not really. He's been in pre-season but not done a lot of games. Not at all. He, again, he's been injured apparently. Uh, he's our record signing as well down at St. Mary's. And he would tear up the championship, I do feel. But it looks like Monaco are going to come in with a bid for £25 million And he has played in France before. And that's where he came from when he, um, Saints snapped him up. So will he make the move back to France and go to Monaco? We will see. I probably think he would, if I'm going to uh, guess. If that bid does come in for Monaco for €25 million, Euros, we get our money back and he moves back to France. And he does not play in the championship. In other transfer news, it looks like Romeo Alavia has accepted or wants to go to Chelsea to join up with Mr. Joe Shields once again. So he's at, with him at Man City. He was with him at Saints. And now it looks like he's going back to win in Chelsea. With a Chelsea's midfield being Enzo, Casido and Lavia. That is a very, very strong midfield indeed. And I think we'll take them to good heights. They looked very good against Liverpool the other day. So it looks like Lavia, Lavia wants to go to London. He was in London this weekend, apparently. He said his goodbyes at St. Mary's. And he looks like he will be joining the Chelsea tonight down at St. Mary's. There will be a fans forum for BBC Radio Show with Adam Blackmore. Blackmore. Uh, where Saints get to Saints fans get to say their piece to Jason Wilcox. I think Russell Martin's there as well, and Andy Parsons. So that's between 6 p.m. and 7 p.m. tonight, Tuesday, the 15th of August. Uh, I will report, try and report back if I can. The facts out of that fans forum they're always interesting, especially being after. A relegation and the transfer window still being open. So most questions are going to be about transfers. There's no doubts about that. Uh, I think that's it from me. So this has been The Saints Show and we are out. Until next time. Laters.